Mark Elliott, the ubiquitous voice of Disney movie trailers, television promos and home video titles from the late 1970s to the early 2000s, has died. He was 81. Elliott died Saturday in a Los Angeles hospital after suffering two heart attacks, friend and fellow voiceover artist Charlie Van Dyke told The Hollywood Reporter. He almost was battling lung cancer. He was one of a kind. And kind is a great word to describe him, Van Dyke said. A well-known radio DJ who became one of Hollywood's premier voiceover artists, Elliot was heard on a slew of movie trailers. He was one of a kind. And kind is a great word to describe him, Van Dyke said in a statement. Born John Harrison Frick Jr. on September 24, 1939 in Cedar Rapids, Iowa, Elliot started his career as a disc jockey and DJ for multiple stations, both under his own name and under the pseudonyms of Sandy Shore, Buddy Harrison, and Ed Mitchell. He would go on to guest host American Top 40 and Casey's Top 40 in the 1970s, 1980s, and 1990s. Elliot began to work in the world of voice over in 1977, with his first paid work on the trailer for Smokey and the Bandit. He went on to do voiceover for radio spots for Star Wars, A New Hope, as well as The Goodbye Girl. While we're working on, Smokey and the Bandit, the voiceover studio, came to me and they said, We got this director who's making us nuts, just driving us crazy, Elliot told Vogue Buzz Weekly in 2015. He can't decide how he wants to promote, his movie, if you'll work with us on spec when he makes his mind up on what he wants. We'll see that you get a big piece of the action. I said okay, so we started working literally seven days a week trying to do it, and he couldn't decide whether he wanted a comedy, whether he wanted an adventure, whether he wanted it dark, whether he wanted it light, whether he wanted romance. He just couldn't decide.